my wonderful and amiibo listeners over the world, wherever you might be hearing me from. Welcome to today's news. The news headline. So, Ludo to Igbos in Lagos, investing in Anambra is your best option. So, Ludo has told Igbos in Lagos State that investing in Anambra is their best option. Come with me as I give you the news in full details. Anambra State Governor Chuko Machao Soludo has warmly advised in the Anambra residents in Lagos State that Anambra State is ready for businesses, adding that investing in the state will be in their own best interest. The governor made the appeal during a town hall meeting with the Indian Anambra residents in Lagos State while enumerating some of the progress made so far by his administration after a year in office. While making his speech, Governor Chukuma Soludo sounded philosophical by telling his audience that God couldn't have made a mistake by making them Onye Anambra. He enjoined them to reflect deeply on it and do everything possible to contribute to the growth of the state. This is the same question I ask myself every day. And we have a responsibility to leave Anambra State better we met, than we met, the governor said. He emphasized on the need to change Anambra State from a departure lounge to a destination, stressing that the homeland consciousness must be inculcated in the perpetual mind of every only Anambra. Your host will never respect you if, if you don't have a livable and prosperous homeland, he reiterated. Speaking on the chaotic nature of Onicha, Governor Chukuma Soludo assured the audience that his government is determined to resurrect Onicha by returning it back to the former glory as the biggest commercial city in the southeast and beyond. On security related issues, the governor maintained that his administration has drastically reduced the menace of killing and kidnapping to the barest minimum with the security architecture architecture put in place by his government. He commended the, the security of forces, the Nigerian Army, Nigerian Navy, the Nigerian Police and State Vigilante Group and other paramilitary agencies for their dodge efforts in, the, in contributing to the successes recorded so far. The governor also told his audience that the first order of business is law and order. And reassured them that law and order has been greatly restored in the state compared to the impunity that had held sway before it came into office. He also reassured that more roads will be flagged off in addition to the over 300 km road already flagged off and are in various stages of completion. To boost power supply in the state, Governor Chukoma Solulu stated that his government recently signed an MOU with EEDC for a 24-hour supply of electricity in the state. He, however, enjoined anyone who is interested in collaborating with his government to set up independent power plants in the state is welcome to do so. On transportation, Governor Chukoma Soludo reassured that his government is working towards the introduction of rail services, both light and sky rail, to improve the transportation system in the state. On health and education, the governor reassured and reassured of adequate human capital investment being put in place with the recent employment of 5,000 teachers and over 300 medical personnel to end the pathetic errors of school without teachers and hospital without doctors and nurses. Governor Chukuma Soludo decried the menace of gully erosion and flooding ravaging the state, assuring that efforts have been exerted to control it. He informed the audience that Anambra Investment Summit will be coming up in September this year, urging every business conscious in the Anambra to join the rest of the world at the summit. He added that the summit will be all about closing deals and agreement signing. Anambra is loading and the options are open, Governor Chukoma Solude further assured. He also appealed to India Anambra to always think home by embedding the homeland consciousness and and to also ensure that part of the taxes are paid to the state irrespective of what their 
where they reside or work, adding that this is the only way they can contribute to the state's development. Others, others who spoke at the occasion commended the effort and dodginess of the governor in completely turning the state around. The event featured key in the Anabra businessmen and women, as well as members of the state executive council. Governor Chuko Masuludo is a Nigerian politician, banker, and economic professor who served as the governor of Anambra State from since March 2022 and is the former governor and chairman of the board of directors of the Central Bank of Nigeria and was appointed as the Central Bank of Nigeria governor on the 29th of May 2004. Governor Chukuma Suludo is a member of the British Department for International Development's International Advisory Group as well as member of President Mamadou Bari Presidential Economy Advisory Committee. In September 2009, Soludo announced his aspiration for the seat of the Governor of Anambra State in the Southern Eastern Nigeria State election on the 9th of February 2010. On the 9th of October 2009, the People Democratic Party chose Soludo as their consensus candidate for the position from a field of 47 candidates after a repeated attempts to hold elective primaries were stalled by court injunctions. However, his nomination were contested by 23 of the 47 aspirants, citing lack of transparency in the process. After this initial round calls, 36 out of the 47 candidates and several top shots of the People Democratic Party affirmed their support for Soludo on Wednesday, 14th of October 2009. Soludo went on to lose to Peter Gregory Obi in an election which was largely considered free and fair, according to the major election observers. However, with his perceived solid performance as CBN governor, Soludo remains a respected economic polit- policy authority in Nigeria. Political commentators, while urging on issue based on campaign in 2011 election had called on aspirants to work with respect, respected economists like Soludo towards an acceptable economic plan. On the, in February 2021, Soludo was declared his, also declared his intention to run for the position of Anambra state governor under the banner of Abga. On the 9th of November 2021, the Independence National Electoral Commission, INEC, announced Soludo as the winner of the 2021 Anambra State gubernatorial election and governor-elect of Anambra State. He, issued a, he was issued a certificate of return on the 13th of November 2021. That will be all for now. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button and let us know your thoughts and your opinion via the comment section below. That will be all for now and I will see you on the next news. Bye for now.